Nah, we've been through that shit though. But nah, that but that I think that right there, when situations like that, that make you stronger, mm -hmm. bro. And it, it's a, I don't even look at it as a uh, L. Darnell Knight told right. me he was like, those you either win or you learn. Right. Yes, you yes, know what I'm saying? That's yes. just the obstacle. Right. You know what I mean? You ain't never did that shit again. You know what I'm saying? Nah, no. It's just a period of time. I feel like for me, I feel like that's God just uh placing you up for something bigger. Like, right. you know what I mean? Yeah, Somebody that's exactly what it was. Hell yeah. Like some people gonna either fold or they gonna keep going bro it's like if you ain't ready to i look at it when god say that like yo you, you gonna go through this test right now if you ain't ready you gonna you, well, i ain't fucking right. with you sure. yeah, yeah. It's a test on me. you gotta do something else yeah. like but you know? a, a lot of times we like the first ones and we we shoot in the dark at shit mm -hmm. we trying to learn shit and mm -hmm. we gonna take l's and lessons because it's nobody pulling us through this situation like with me i'm just i'm out here just Doing it, you know what I'm saying? Because there's no information. Hey, man, look, you need to do this. No do this, do this. Mm -hmm. So I'm just learning as I go. But right. I'm leaving the crumbs for everybody behind me because, right. I'm, hey, man, you need to go get that trademark before you do this. You know what I'm saying? But I didn't have nobody that showed me the game. For sure. You know what it was? It, it's like, for me, bro, I didn't go to college. I wasn't the smartest nigga in high school. But at the end of the day, logic makes sense. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And that's what some things that we have is logic. And... You have to fuck up in order to learn. Yeah. You know what I mean? So it's no blueprint to be successful. Right. You know what I mean? And, and we got kids, bro. Like, you know, so for me, I looked at it like I don't want them to go through the same shit we going through. Sure. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. If we could, like, because you got to understand, like, nigga, every other race got it ahead of us. Yeah, yeah, like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, like the white people, <laughs> yeah. like, no disrespect to y'all, but at the end of the day, it's like, nigga, mm -hmm. When when y'all was owning crop fields and slaves and shit, y'all niggas got the advantage. Y'all niggas can fuck. Four hundred years ahead, man. You feel four hundred years ahead, my nigga. They be looking like why we. But you, but you say that too. But also, if we have four hundred years ahead, I think us as a culture would still hide the fucking information for the next culture. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Because I, it's just it just seems like we don't we don't help each other. Nah. You know what I'm saying? And it's crazy. It's like. You could go a black owned business, you'd be like, oh, I'm not shopping there. I'm gonna go over there. Why? Right. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy. Start thinking about that shit. It's like you quit to spend your money somewhere else, but when you start talking about black owned businesses, you second guess the shit. Right. Oh, I can't give them my credit card. They might scam yeah. me. You know what I'm saying? Just natural shit like that. You, you pay attention to that shit. And that shit crazy. And I don't know why we think. So we would say we would be ahead if we had so many years in front of doing this shit. I don't think we would. 